I started doing drag because um, a bunch of my fraternity brothers did it. I'm in Delta Lambda Phi, which is a social fraternity for gay, bisexual, trans, and progressive men. And um, they did it because, like, I didn't know anything about drag. And I remember when I started going to the clubs after I turned 18, the summer before my freshman year, I saw drag queens at the club, and I was like, oh, that's really weird. Uh, but then, like, I met drag queens, and I was like, oh, this is really awesome. It was a lot of fun. I went to drag shows. And then I decided I wanted to try it, but it's so hard to get started because you have no idea what to do. Um, and, like, it's, when you saw all my stuff, like, it takes a lot. It's, like, it's so expensive to start out. So I, like, slowly collected things over time. And um, they helped me a lot. My grandma, my dad's mom, she watched Drag Race before I did. And so it was, she was ecstatic when I told her. And, like, she bought my first heels for me. And, like, so we got some makeup and stuff. Christina Aguilar is my inspiration for drag because uh, of how sexually empowered she is and how much she loves herself unapologetically. Um, I just really like strong women figures. My drag name is Camira Jane and then like my like subtitle, I don't know what it's called, is like Prima Donna of the World. Um, drag also helps me, it's helped me like with my self-confidence, like my body image um, a lot and I, that's like I do wear a lot of lingerie and like really revealing stuff. And, uh, but it's helped me uh, to be more confident about my body 